you guys. Hello, hello. What's going on? We are back for another day of streaming. Thanks for tuning in today. Uh, the plan is going to be sort of the normal, um, the, the Big 109, the Big 162, Big 55, all those tournaments, the HOTS. We'll probably run a home game as well, as it's Friday, so there isn't like any huge 1K tournament or something like that, so it's going to be a nice, steady, chill grind, and hopefully we come out at the end of the day with a little bit more money. So, let's uh, blow up the universe and streamception. Um, so I guess we'll check here with the Queens three ways. I think it's fine. Jimmy should stream more of these times for your European fans. I'm happy to see your stream alive again for a long time from Lamalones. Cheers, man. I'm glad you're uh, you're enjoying. I'm going to be streaming probably a little bit earlier than this, actually, when I'm over in Europe, depending on how, how things shake down. So, yeah. I mean, this I planned to actually start an hour and 20 minutes ago. I only slept like five hours last night because I was booking flights and stuff, but... Uh, that's generally going to be what the plan is. They bet 841 on the river here. I think we'll call um, on this Jack River. The... Uh, maybe not. I don't know if we can put them on enough flush draws, actually. Uh, we'll probably call. I think calling is good. We're pretty under reps. They have ace-king. Let's go here to the flip. No. No. They ran out of straight. Oh, yeah. Back to 35k. We were all in with ace-king there. So we call with the Queen-10 suited here in the 1650 turbo, and we see a pretty decent flop for our hand. Pretty decent. 30k day today. Let's go, dude. Winbot. 30k day. All right. I like how you're you're setting your sights high, man. See a bet and a raise, and now our life is kind of difficult, actually. Um, there's 756 in there, 1800 in the pot total. Cheddar Stack probably has a one-pair hand way more than they have flush draws here. So I think we go with our hand in the 1650 Turbo. Really sucks when we see the ace high flush draw as well. Uh, but usually they're going to have one-pair type hands. They make a full house in the turn, so unfortunately our, our flush is not going to get there. A little bit of a weird spot three ways. Like, basically their range was changed by the way it was played after the flop. So even though they still have the same hands, the way it was played was changed, right? Raise here, we call. So, I mean, they have a, a decent amount of aces here, a decent amount of broadways, etc. Uh, and then we see a lead for 300. So what is this lead of 300? I mean, it doesn't really make too much sense. It's usually a weak-ish type hand. Um, and then a raise. And what's Cheddar Sack's range for raising to this size as well? This 750. I think that... We're going to see aces a lot. Just one pair of aces, a decent amount. Ace king, ace queen, as well as ace jack, yes. Um, I don't think they're going to be raising like the ace high flush draw to the size unless they have like ace king suited. We block ace queen suited. We block ace ten suited. Um, so I think like ace king suited raises to this size and ace king and ace queen and ace jack. In which case, we're going with our queen ten suited. The question is if Fop Nada bets their ace high flush draw like this, then we should probably not go all in. But I don't think they do. A weird hand. Weird hand there. Uh, hi to your friend as well, Matchy. Hi to your friend. We open the jacks. We get three bet by ESP2011. Another jacks here. And what to do now? What to do now? So we're not folding, right? So the question is, do we want to call or shove? With them having 32 big blinds. Um, and I, I feel like it's kind of close, actually. Between call and shove. I think both are profitable. And I think shove's got to be better than calling. Uh, with them having 25 big blinds. This is a regular. So I don't know like what their strategy is with... 10s and 9s and 8s and 7s, and hands like ace-queen offsuit like we saw there. Uh, clearly ace-queen offsuit was going for it. Um, but what about ace-check suited? Does that go for it too? Tough to say. Let's go up to the kings here in the 22-10 gay. See what we can do with this. And we see an open to 300. I think in this random 22, I mean not a random 22, the 22 10k, like three betting is going to be better. Uh, sometimes I'd be calling here as you guys know, but I don't think I have enough history built up with cash or the rest of the table that makes calling better. And we just see a shove here. 
Open for this player to come along, obviously. Hey man, I started about thirty-five dollars. Was hovering, hovering around fifty the last couple days. Decided to play two, three dollars spinning goes. So this is down three, four dollars on the day from huge variance. And one was six dollars. I basically went all in and lost. And the other was seventy-five dollars. I managed to win. Holy crap, man! Congratulations on the seventy-five. That's sick. Uh, I went a bit more and made it to a hundred twenty-dollar bankroll. Congratulations, yo! That's awesome. That's a huge bank. I just wanted to keep you updated on my journey. Leaf Cena, please do. Oh, th that was your message. There we go. Uh, Leaf Cena, that's great. I mean, your bankroll is growing, man. Keep it up. Keep it up. We call... Oh! Not the ace ace. That's not the dream. Not the dream. Let's go up to the aces. Okay. Aces in the 44 turbo. I got one of these going on. Let's go. Okay. Let's win the money here. Open under the gun from Progree69. As of right now, it's looking like a call. Unless we go multi-way. Unless we see like a lot of other people enter the pot. And I call on the button. I'm going to call. I'm going to slow play the aces because I don't think that I bluff very much here. We see an ace-10-6 flop. We flop the top set, which is great. You know, we have a really strong hand. But it's bad at the same time, and that it's kind of hard for them to have much <clears throat> here. Bet a 600. And call from Tazja. I think we want to check shove now. We want to get all the money from draws and stuff like that, which there's going to be a decent amount. Um, and we don't want to give free cards to just, like, diamond decks, you know? Or the straight draws. The 7-8, the 7-9, the 8-9, the jack-queen, the jack-king, and... The Queen King. How do live tells affect your play a style live cash game, live tourney? Do you play way more exploitative? Yeah, I mean, I play as exploitative as I can. Um, even online, I'll play fairly exploitative style. Nat Singer. Um, so yeah, you can you can use tells to your advantage, right? If you're perceptive and you pick things up. So we're 22 of 194 here, page 36. First place is 2300. And aces. All right, <laughs> this is a good end. Let's raise it up to 420 under the gun. For a long time, it folds. Warm up was 23, I think. We won 23 in the warm up. That was last year, though. If you're talking like calendar year, our big score this year is, uh, is 5K. Yeah, the delay is to prevent snipers, exactly. Just so that people don't know our cards. Do we hold? Yeah. We do, 2800 coming our way. That is sweet. We're up to 8800 now, you guys, in the 44 turbo. Over the Queens, we get a reshub to 7400. We must call now. All right, when he moves to Prague, I'll no longer be a viewer. Sad face, why not, Winbot? Why not? We're not gonna start at the same time of day. I'll try and adjust when I play poker during the day. No! Please stop having it. Or just get there. Ha <laughs> Oh, we're running good today. Okay, King's here in the big 55. Nice pick. Thank you. Thank you. There was no names on top of, uh, of Switzerland, though, so we nailed it. Hey, the Kings. The King King Dream. Hold, Dottie. I can't say Stoose. Oh, no. I knew it. I knew it was coming. I didn't actually know, but you can tell me, like, you sometimes get that sound when you're on downswings. You're like, oh, God, you're just preparing yourself for the worst. All right, we're down to 8.2K. <laughs> what are your thoughts on Steve O'Dwyer? The guy's uh, another one of those guys in the top 15. Seems to be winning everything right now. So props to him. Uh, a bet of 76.50. There's a lot of turns that kill our action or kill our hand, so I'm going to raise now and probably just shove. We'll just shove with the 10 9. Hope they have like aces or whatever. Call us. All right. Hope we dodge. <laughs> we do. All right. Well, magic. We're up to 87K, you guys. We are 14 of 80, and this is becoming a reality. Let's keep going. Ace King suited here. We're going to raise up to 5K. And Heidiberg, three bets to 12,000. Um, so what are we gonna do? Heidi Berg's sitting on almost 200k here, so the answer is going to be put more money in the pot. Um, how is the 
question. There's 22,000 out there, so we can make it like this and never fold. That's probably a mistake because we're always going to be priced in, so I think I'm going to shove here for 75k. The days getting suited. Against queens, we have a huge flip, you guys, for 155k. That's a good flop. Do we hold, you guys? Do we hold? Yes, we do. We're up to 155,600 chips in a huge position. Let's keep it going. I think I'm ace jack suited now. Come on. Come on, give us one. We're going to balance. We're going to have a player move in from the other table. A Rofigo, a 77 opens under the gun. We're going to call. Uh, we did see Rofigo play a pretty wide hand, that hand before. Um, so something to, to make note of here. Folds around to FK, who folds. Wow, folds. All right. Rofigo checks on this Jack-8-4 board, which is pretty interesting. I think we're going to bet. I feel very comfortable with our hand right now. Um, with our top pair, top pair against Rofigo. I think they're the kind of player that's like really willing to shovel some chips around. And that's like good for us with this hand. So we're going to bet 37k here. Uh, 39k maybe. Resub hype. Uh, the Alfred's 9,000 with a sub. Welcome to Staple Stable Hearts out in chat, you guys. Thank you so much for the love, man. We get a check call again. And then a six on the river. Do we want to bet for value? I think so. Um, 72,000. Sounds good. Sub hype, Mickey424. Thank you so much for the sub. Welcome to the team. Welcome to Staple Stable Hearts out in chat, you guys. As we chip up to 415K. I'm here. We're going to be at the final table. We're going to be guaranteed at least $805. We're going to do a lemon lion. Resub hype, Chipotle power. Thank you so much, man. This is it. <sighs> Let's go, you guys. Final table hype of the big 55. We are seven of nine right now. Pocket vibes. These are going to be going all in, you guys. For us, we are the shortest stack by about two and a half stacks right now. So there's not a ton of pressure for us to like wait or for other people to bust. We are the shortest. Our fives are going to be ahead, unless there's like a raise and a re-raise, in which case we could probably get rid of it. Uh, but without it, I think it's a pretty clear spot for us to roll. Roll with the fives. So this is going to be it. This could be make or break. This could put us back in a position to win $13,000, or this could send us home with fourteen eighty. dollars We're going to find out in a moment. It's a big spot. It's a couple K in equity here. A couple thousand dollars. Here we go. Against Diso. Who calls? Against 10 9. We're actually slightly behind in this flip. Now we're really far behind. We've died. We've died. In eighth place. We cash for 1486, you guys. Um, thank you for hanging out, by the way. We'll take it off some moment when we see this. Uh, I feel pretty comfortable with how I played the final table. Obviously, we made some, some pretty big folds that I am, I feel like not a lot of people are going to understand, but um, I feel pretty good about how I played. I think I played well, and uh, we gave ourselves a shot at winning a huge tournament. Let's GG. GG, good luck to these guys. Um, that's going to be it for me. So I'm going to get on the work grind tonight. I'm going to get some stuff done. Tomorrow, I'm starting a little bit late, you guys. I'm starting at 12 Mountain, which will be around 2 p.m. Eastern time, approximately. It's going to be up in the air, so just follow my social media if you want to check it out. Thank you guys so much for sweating with me on this final table. It was a lot of fun. If you like the stream, hit the follow button down below. Uh, it's free. Thanks to the subs and the donos and, and everyone hanging out today. It, it, uh, it was a lot of fun, you know? And we're going to give it another shot tomorrow, but that's poker, okay? But until tomorrow, until next time, whenever I see you, that's it for me. Talk to you guys later.